Um, hello, uh, welcome to part four. This is going to be on the blindfold. Um, so what we're focusing on here is we're looking at um, what she cannot see and also the fact that she can't see. So when we look around, um, there's a lot of dark blues and dark greens and um, a lot of darkness here. Um, so these colors and shades are associated with sadness and pessimism, um, meaning that like your outlook on life is not very great. So the blindfold kind of takes on a negative meaning um, in this painting. So being blindfolded stops the wearer from seeing what is around them and coming. That's pretty obvious, right? Like you close your eyes, um, basically to what is going on around you. Um, so depression dampens the senses, makes fun activities seem pointless, and makes the future seem darker than it could be. So it's basically acting the same as if you were wearing a blindfold. Um, so under this blindfold, she might see literal darkness, but it could also symbolize um, what we just discussed. Like she has a bleak outlook, on the future, she might think she's doomed, and she's also seeing darkness in the present, so things are not going well in her eyes. Um, so the blindfold is literally depression masking her outlook on life. She can't see the highlights on the painting. So like right here, and then there's like some light up here, a light source, and then there's also some light still on this globe. So obviously there are parts of her life that are highlighted, but mm -hmm. her depression blinds her from seeing them. So this all kind of just has to do with um, a poor outlook, sadly.